wildlife is always fascinating. Let's go on a journey to explore them. Jump in. The palm cockatoo, also known as the goliath cockatoo or great black cockatoo, is a large smoky gray or black parrot of the cockatoo family native to New Guinea, Aru Islands, and Cape York Peninsula. It has a very large black beak and prominent red cheek patches. It may be the largest cockatoo species and largest parrot in Australia, although large races of yellow-tailed black cockatoos and sulfur-crested cockatoos broadly overlap in size. It is a distinctive bird with a large crest and has one of the largest bills of any parrot. This powerful bill enables palm cockatoos not only to eat very hard nuts and seeds, but also enables males to break off thick sticks from live trees to use for a drumming display. The male has a larger beak than the female. The beak is unusual, as the lower and upper mandibles do not meet for much of its length, allowing the tongue to hold a nut against the top mandible while the lower mandible works to open it. The palm cockatoo also has a distinctive red cheek patch that changes color when the bird is alarmed or excited. It has a large and complex vocal repertoire, including many whistles, and even a hello call that sounds surprisingly human-like. Distinct dialects occur throughout the species' range. Anecdotal evidence indicates a palm cockatoo reaching 80 or 90 years of age in an Australian zoo, although the oldest confirmed individual was aged 56 in London Zoo in 2000. It is found in rainforests and woodlands of New Guinea and Cape York Peninsula, Queensland, Australia. It can still be found near Sarong, West Papua, Indonesia, where it is sometimes seen in trees along the roads. It has a unique territorial display where the bird drums with a large stick or seed pot against a dead bough or tree, creating a loud noise that can be heard up to 100 meters away. After drumming, the male occasionally strips the drum tool into small pieces to line the nest. Although this drumming behavior was discovered over two decades ago, the reason why palm cockatoos drum is still a mystery. One reason could be that females can assess the durability of the nesting hollow by the resonance of the drumming. The palm cockatoo is an unusual bird, being an ancient species, and one of the few bird species known to use tools. They only lay one egg every second year, and have one of the lowest breeding success rates reported for any species of parrot. Offsetting this is their very long lifespan. A male commenced breeding at 29 in Tarana Zoo in Sydney, and a female at the London Zoo was 40 when she laid her first egg in 1966. Breeding takes place inside tree hollows that look like standing pipes. Fires play an important role in the destruction and creation of nest hollows. Fires allow the colonization of microorganisms and termites, which enter the tree and start hollowing out the inside. Cyclones are important in the final stage of nest hollow development. It often feeds during the early hours of the day on a diet that consists mostly of wild-growing pandanus palm fruit and nuts from the canary tree. They have also been seen eating fruit from Darwin's stringy bark eucalyptus tetradonta and nanda tree, as well as seeds from the cocky apple tree, beech almond, and black bean tree. I am grateful for your time and patience. We will meet soon. Till then, be good.